Hello, Earth children. Mr. Bruce here with today's book, which is, What Does It Mean to Be Kind? Well, before we start, eyes watching, ears listening, voices quiet, body calm, and we shall read. What does it mean to be kind? Okay. Does being kind mean paying for something at the store with something other than money? No, that's not being in kind. That's being in kind. Does being kind mean being sort of something, like something? No, that's kind of. That's not like kind. That's like kind of look like those hats. What being kind is, it means, well, sometimes it means smiling at the new student in the class who's feeling a little bit nervous about being there and not knowing anybody. That's one way you can be kind. Or being kind means giving somebody a compliment. Oh, I like your painting. That's being kind. Being kind could be holding the door open for somebody else who's going through rather than having it slam right in their face. That's a good way to be kind. Being kind, it could mean sticking up for someone who's being bullied. Hey, if somebody's bullying somebody else, you can say, hey, stop that. That's not right. That's being kind. Being kind is seeing the best in people, even when they're struggling to be their best. That means when somebody's having a bad day and maybe they're a little whiny or cry or being a little pushy, well, you try to understand and be nice to them because maybe they're having a bad day and that's why they're acting that way. Never hurts to be kind. Being kind means forgiving somebody who's hurt you. If a friend has said something to you and made you feel sad or if they've hurt you in the playground and they say, I'm sorry, it always is kind to say that. Sometimes being kind is helping an injured or a lost animal. If you see an animal that's lost and bring it home, that's the best thing you can do. Or if you see he's hurt and help him, that's a very kind thing to do because animals can't give themselves band-aids or do their own owies. Being kind means being patient. That means waiting your turn, even when you're in a hurry. Being kind is saying please and thank you and you're welcome and I'm, I'm sorry. All those things that you know about that make other people feel better. Being kind means celebrating with everybody, no matter how different you are. If you have different holidays or different clothes or eat different food, it doesn't make any difference. You can all celebrate the things you have in common. Being kind means encouraging somebody who needs some help or support. Go on, you can do it, you can do it. It's nice when your friends help you like that when you're in a race or running or trying something. Being kind could be picking up trash from the ground, even when it's not yours. Look at all those cans on the ground. It's nice to pick up litter, even if you didn't do it. Everybody can appreciate it. Being kind is allowing yourself to make and learn from your mistakes. If you drop something or leave something home or forget to bring something in for school or you just make a mistake in school and reading maybe, that's all right. Everybody makes mistakes. And you have to learn to allow yourself to make them because that's how you learn. Being kind means noticing when someone is sad and taking the time to understand why. Hey, you don't look like you're happy. Is anything wrong? Can I help you with anything? That's a good way to be kind. Being kind could also be caring for those who don't have as much as you. Some people don't have as much food or they don't have as much money, or they don't have a nice place to stay. And you can help other people when they're, when they're down on their luck, and they'll help you in the future. What goes around comes around, right? So show your friends what it means to be kind all the time and spread the word. If we can all be kind to each other and to ourselves, the world will be a more loving and caring place. The
end. Can you think of any way that you can be kind, maybe at home or at school? Maybe you can be kind to a brother or a sister or say something nice to your mommy if she's not feeling bad or take care of your kitties. Anyway, anytime you think about it and say, hey, if I do this, it would be a kind thing to do. It's always the right thing to do. Okay, I'll see you next week. Until then, be good and wash your hands. Bye-bye.